calm. You're a queen. You're unflappable. Suck my frigging butt, you backstabbing punks! Chug my dump truck, you stinky wimps! Beep, beep, garbage butt backing up! I hate the battle toads. <laughs> Hey, Queen, correct me if I'm wrong. Earlier, did I hear you scream that we stink? What? No, I was talking about the cattle toads. Like you guys, but cattle. They stink. I'm so friggin' pumped, we're gonna be famous. Sup, Topian scum? We just stole a spaceship, and we're coming for you. The Battle Toads and the Dark Queen are gonna destroy you. And in case you're wondering, our exact space coordinates are 3x5. Four, three. Stop that! Your Majesties? Yes, mortal. Moments ago, we received this transmission. The Battle Toads and the Dark Queen are gonna destroy you! <gasps> Did that voice just say it was going to destroy us? Who would want to destroy you? You've got the most amazing shape. I'm wearing Nebulas from Zorthos. You know, the cluster with the gross bugs? Oh, the gross bugs. See, I think they're cute bugs. With their little wobble. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the wobble. I wonder if they're ready to evolve. <sighs> Might be fun to set them up. With the fourth dimension? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> now see, this is why little old me and you run the universe. Oh, great ones. What do you want to do about the Dark Queen and the Battletoads? Huh? Oh, alert the galaxy and kill them. And I'm waiting on a sandwich. <laughs> great torturing, torture team. <laughs> Forgive me. Forgive? More like 400 lashes. <laughs> See what I did there? I took four. Oh, I love it. Whip him. Yes, and hear that pun in your nightmare. Yeah. Whip him. Whip him good. That should be a song. Write that down. Pardon my interruption, oh floating ones, but we still haven't located the Dark Queen. Oh my god, what kind of an update is that? Yeah, restaurants don't say, excuse me, we haven't started making your food. Oh, you know, that one place did. Oh, that's right. The place that's mean on purpose. I don't want to pay you to be mean to me. That's what I have a mother for. Have you found the other ones? The, uh, arbal toes? The t total loads? Oh, the things we're looking for. The brut brutables. Bartle bears? The tattle toes? The beetle bugs? Fire bats? The jitsu bats? Battle... Battle bees? That's it. That's it. Battle bees. The battle bees. The battle toads. I'm afraid they've eluded capture as well. What? What did you do? Well, I made him three inches shorter. Doesn't seem like much, but his entire life will change. Now, do your job before I give you combination skin. That's like when part of your skin is dry. Parts are oily and parts are dry. Right. We need the right product. Yeah. Those ugly toads and that spinny little witch might be more of a formidable team than we thought. We couldn't do this without you. You're the most important member of the team. Just don't tell the others I said that, okay? Where are we? Jerkery 9, an outer ring planet and home to an old cohort of mine named Jeffrey. And he's see-through? Cool. He's a well-connected diplomat who knows of a secret entrance into Topian City. However, I need to speak with him alone. Okay, what's going on here? I thought I was a leader. Are you all conspiring behind my back? Seriously, like, am I being Do I sound crazy? Am I crazy right now? No, no way. You're the leader. Okay, good. Great. In that case, I say the queen waits outside while we talk to Jeff. You don't even know Jeff. Why would he trust you? Why do you trust me? I don't. That's why I don't want you talking to Jeff. Too bad. I'm pulling rank. This is so stupid. Stupid. I declare one of those thingies. A tissue boom? Toe shampoo! Toe shampoo! Toe shampoo! Toe shampoo! And introducing the Dark Queen! Dark Queen loses! Dark Queen loses! Dark Queen loses! Dark Queen loses! Again! Sorry, Queen. Call me if you have any problems. Oof. Talk about a superiority complex. Okay, everyone, keep your eyes peeled for- Jeff! 
I'm Jeff. How may I help you? Yeah, hi. I'm in charge here, and we're gonna need you to tell us the secret way in Utopian City, please. And thank you. We're working with the Dark Queen. She works for us, actually? The Dark Queen is challenging the Topians? Of course I'll share the coordinates. However, I'll need to speak with the Queen herself alone. We can call her. No. Anything you would tell her, you can tell us. Uh, that's the opposite of what I said. <laughs> Not to mention, I'm busy negotiating peace between two warring tribes by acquiring their medallions of respect. So, unless you connect me with the Dark Queen immediately, we have nothing left to discuss. Here. No! Give it here! Uh. Hello? Is something wrong? Uh, 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 Jeff is fine. Jeff is fine. It's a weird thing to say. Can I talk to him? <clears throat> this is Jeff. Jeff, you sound different. I have pink eye. Pink eye doesn't change how you sound. I mean, pink mouth? So sorry, it's super pink. Gotta go. Bye. Whew. That bought us some time. Time for what? Time to help Jeff's body earn those medallions. He'll wake up and see what we did and then fork over the coordinates. Any objections? Will it matter? No, it will not. Let's find those medallions. Toads, I've intercepted radio chatter about a Topian checkpoint in the area. Be careful, and don't leave the palace. That would be stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Ow! Oh, crap! There's a bee in the spaceship! Ow, ow, ow!
Look, that wooden gladiator has a medallion of respect. He's fighting in a nearby arena. How do you know? It's written on the billboard. Rash, can you read? <laughs> you kidding? I read tons of... Borgs.
Look, it's Jeff. How did he beat us here? I think some things in life just won't make sense. What do you mean? Like, maybe God didn't have the time or the budget to make everything perfect, or maybe there were just some outside mitigating circumstances. Sounds like a lot of excuses. Yes, it does, Rash. Yes, it does.